Welcome to another exciting episode down on the allotment. What's going on today? Not a lot. Not a lot. <laughs> um, I won't give you a boring tour, but yeah, it's not much been going on. So uh, obviously we had a bit of wind the other week. I uh, really didn't do much damage. I noticed that our gates off on the other plot that had been completely torn off. I don't know if it was the wind or someone after my pears. I think it was someone after my pears. But, uh, let's go and see what Kim's doing. What you doing? <gasps> we still getting runners? Yeah. Look at them. They're mad, aren't they? Yeah. Just don't stop throwing. As you notice, um, I got the spuds up last week. Uh, we had two rows here. Um, I'll show you in a little picture here the size of them. I think I'd left them in too long. That's something as big as my head. So the plan for the day is to um, de-weed this whole area, so a lot of digging, and get it looking like this bed over here, just looking nice, nothing's popped up for it, so uh, I've done me, uh, me weeding correctly, obviously, it's nothing, it's looking good that's all, apart from the clay, but uh, I'll mix some stuff in with that later on. I don't know, a bit of manure or some um, Epsom salts. Get some goodness back into it. Project Shed, still not on the go. Uh, flower Garden, uh, coming to the end of its cycle. Still looking alright though, not bad. Chilies, they're coming on nice. Oh! Fall over a bit. We'll get a few of them today. And uh, obviously from the tomatoes, um, yeah, there's a picture. Just too many tomatoes. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'll crack on with a bit of digging. There's no need to watch me do that. Boring. I suppose I could uh, do a bit of uh, fast time and a bit of music. Yeah, so um, yeah, a bit of digging then, is it, Kim? You are, I am. <laughs> you can, I'm not. Well, you go. Bit of digging it is then. I might just let these, um, the rest of them, I think I'll just let them dry out now. You've got some down there anyway that are drying out. Yeah, Andy, yeah, look. Yeah. There's a few. Oh, lovely. Crispy. Beautiful. Crispy peas. Beans. Beans, even. Beans. Right, uh, see you in a minute.
World. at all. Uh, got quite a bit of buying weed out of it and Kim's taking the top off of that lot so that would be me, me next bit to dig up so that's quite a large bed that one but I thought I'd do the potato one today get that one out and done. Um, yeah I'm pretty happy with the saw the spuds have done their work sort of um, broken up quite a lot of the clay which is good as you see there's a lot of clay on the other one so we'll probably do spuds again in there next year. Uh, so the plan is, is to get the other one dug through, completely uh, get all the nastiness out of it, and then I'll come up with the rotavator, uh, till it over, get it all nice and fine, add some Epsom salts, and then uh, cover it. Yeah. yeah, not too bad. Not too shabby. Right, Kim has done her weeding over here. Pulled up the rest of the collies because um, we've tried collies and they're just not working. Mind you, we've got winter collies there, they're not looking too bad. Uh, got a lone um, Swede, but these cabbages are looking nice. Yeah, the experimental. Um, what are they? Parsnips. The experimental parsnip box. What, oh, mate? Yeah, the experimental um, parsnip box. Um, now this side, uh, we put a little bit of manure in it, and this side we've done nothing. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, not looking too bad. Hopefully they're getting long. Uh, and then we've got Kim's parsnips over here. Mine best be better than hers. They better come out better than hers. Because it'll be a fight if they don't. Big fisted cuffs. So I'll have a haul for today. There's a little cherry tomatoes. Got some peppers. And some... Hoshi tomatoes. And some money makers, some big old whoppers in there, a few spuds that I've dug up that uh, obviously left in the ground from the other day, and some beans. Not a bad haul, Ma. No. no. So that's that for the day. That's not been a long one. Only been up here a couple of hours, but enough's enough. We've all gone dizzy. It's because we haven't eaten. Oh, we've gone dizzy. Ooh, nearly passed out then. Go home. Go home. Keep me phone home. Keep me phone home. Go home, Malcolm. She was cold. Right, so. Coat. Yeah, get me coat and um, uh, hose away. Um. The ghost busting, the ghost busting channel that we got, uh, we've got another one booked and it's not until December. Um, Wymering Manor is supposed to be the place to go for haunty, but we'll go there and um, we'll try and uh, 
that sensed it all. Find out if there really is or really ain't. Oh. Mommy, Ghostbusters. Always scare the willies out of Kim, one of the two. So that's not until December. Uh, we'll try and get another one in before then. Ah, but as for this up here, uh, as and when, because I don't want to just keep coming up and doing tour wars because they get boring. Uh, there's really not much going on until I start getting the shed done. So until you see me next time, all we'll have a good one. See you later. Bye bye. Take care all. Bye. Uh -huh. <laughs>